I'm on a boat. I'm on a mother boat. Let's go. <laughs> How's it going, guys? This is Born a Dream here again with episode number 10 of Super Pokemon Eevee. And like I said, we're on a boat. <laughs> um, so, yeah. Uh, a boat. And loud noises. Attention, passengers. We are now setting sail to Ignis Island. Nice. What's this kid doing? Come back, kid. We the rock in this ship makes me move faster. That's great. Let's check. Oh, hi, you. I haven't had a good bio in a while. Yeah, I haven't either. <laughs> None of these terms are giving me any good battles. If we're being completely honest here. Let's put you to sleep. Um Yeah, so uh this ship is gonna get a little interesting. Alright, did I already put you guys to sleep? Oh I have surf now. Forget about that. I can just like throw an entire ocean at Pokemon. Isn't Pokemon great? We can like blast fire to each other and like smack each other multiple times in the head our Pokemon can you know isn't isn't that just what makes Pokemon great literally throwing an ocean at these Pokemon I don't know how they survive but okay yeah you're terrible Phoenix down where do I heal here uh you're kind of interesting Oh, do people, do people always barge into strangers' rooms? Yep, deal with it. <laughs> uh, this man has never played a Pokemon game. Yeah, we always just walk right into someone's room. Oh, looks like this is my room. Yeah, we like, no one changes clothes in this game. We all just wear the same clothes like year round, so there's no chance of nudity in Pokemon. We just sit here and like wear the same stinky clothes cuz apparently no one can smell in this game. Are you sure it was okay for us to be here? I know there was no receptionist, but still. It's a small startup company. I figured they couldn't even hire a receptionist. So this is Silfco. The next person of the on the list is named Vanessa Wish. Vanessa Wish. She's the head researcher here. Wish is a weird last name. A researcher, and she's meant to be important to the world. Yep. Like she's just chilling right there. She's not even working. She's just standing there staring into space. Are you Vanessa Wish? I told you I didn't want to be interrupted. Oh, sorry. I mistook you for Anna, my assistant, but not her receptionist. My name is Tom Del Exxon. Eh, I missed that. Who? Do you know of Zaya? Oh, so it wasn't a dream. A month ago, I was contacted by an entity calling itself Zaya. It mentioned someone would be coming. So, will you give your life to Zaya for unlimited power? I don't know. You don't have to give me an answer right now. I'll be returning in a year's time. Okay, I'll have an answer by then. I look forward to meeting you again. <laughs> These people are always like stunned. Like, will you give your life for Zaya? Uh, I don't know. What the hell kind of question is that? And he's just casually like, we'll come back in a year's time. And they're just sitting there stunned like, what the fuck just happened? Attention passengers. Could the passenger B to D make his way up to the captain he captain quarters? I almost said headquarters. The captain has asked to meet you. Huh? What does the captain want now? Um. He probably stopped eating Magikarp and is now starting to eat Gyarados. And I guess he wants me to help him uh, cut up the Gyarados. I want to see if I can get this. Eh. 
There's like a cool way like Vaporeon will like walk. Just snuck. Oh, did you want some? Wait, what? Just snuck out of the kitchen with a whole turkey. Oh, did you want some? No, that's quite all right. Thank God. Fat boy. Ah, fuck it. Oh, hi you. I feel like I'm gonna get seasick. Yeah, I do too. I'm gonna get so sick because, you know, nobody changes their clothes in this game. And it's kind of getting to me now. Like, I've been in this world for like two years, but now I'm just starting to notice the smell. Because, you know, Pokemon. Nightshade on you. Let's, like, Bubble Beam. I don't know. You, I guess. Surf everybody. Surf's up, bro! Okay. Sorry about that. Smog. Okay, you two are gone. Now I can just focus on the Corefish. Tackle. There you go. Good. Good, good, good. Crab Claw. Green Seed. Ember Pieces. Ooh! Am I getting a Machoke? Wait. Oh, that's 24. Why was I thinking 28? What the fuck? Oh, I gotta keep an eye on Ghastly. I have to keep an eye on you. Wait. Keep missing this. Watching shipwreck movies was a bad idea. I hope we talk soon. <laughs> okay. I don't wanna go too far. Oh, hi, you. Boats always have strong trainers. It's like the minute you walk through a door, somebody just like smacks you around right the face. And it's like, let's battle! Well, I am kind of barging in, so I probably deserve it. But, I mean, like, no one's getting dressed in this game, so, like, why does it matter? There's no nudity in Pokemon. I don't know why I'm repeating jokes, I just am. Deal with it. <laughs> okay. I can't throw water at people anymore, that kind of sucks. I like throwing water at people. I have an obsession of throwing water at people. Whether it's healthy or not, I don't know, but... Okay, the bar is going really slow. You need to recharge. You need to kick people in the face. And... Vaporeon and Ghastly need to not be paralyzed. Yeah, this bar is going really slow. Dizzy Punch you. It won't take you out. Can I throw water at people again? I want to do that. Uh, Dizzy Punch you. I'm not going to throw water at people. That's not nice. Actually, I will. I'll just squirt it at people instead. Throw it. Okay. Wait. Bruce gained another level? Oh! <gasps> I'm gonna get a Pikachu! OMG, I've always wanted a Pikachu. Random baton pass in there. Not like I don't have a million of these. <gasps> okay, this is interesting. Nah, we'll save it for uh, Ghastly. I'm deciding who to use a rare candy on. Am I good for HP? Eh, I could be better, but oh well. Oh, I have another room. And people just run straight at you. Get out of my house, man. Uh, Tetra Element. Can we not do this? Come on, just let me use it. Thank you. Uh, throw water at people. Uh, make them dizzy and punch them. Aww. Why'd you have to do Jolteon like that? Uh, yeah, I want to use that. And then I want to, like... Too bad Jolteon doesn't get Thunderbolt. Uh, not through level up anyways. Ooh, that did a nice chunk. Do I get Discharge? Oh, can we not do this, please? Uh, Dizzy Punch you. Oh, you're not even doing anything. You're paralyzed. Poison everyone. <sighs> Come on. Lucky chant, really? Okay, well, Ice Fang you. 
I'm just attacking random <laughs> shit. I'm trying to like balance it out and take them all out at the same time with Surf. I guess that's kind of my strategy right now. I don't know how well it's working, but we'll see right now. Oh, you can't use Surf. I can't throw water at people. Damn it. Let's uh, use... Where is it? Elixir. I don't want to use Elixir. Oh, I'll just use it. Yeah. We'll Thunderfang you. Okay. Thunderfang again. This is a uh, much longer battle than it needs to be. Okay, smog. Throw water at people. Yeah, there we go. That's what I was trying to do the entire time. Okay. Shadowstone. Beak Spear. Yay, I can evolve Ghastly. Okay. Uh, let me see. Rare Candy. On Smiley McGee. And now I got a Haunter. Which is kind of nice. I need to look up how to evolve Haunter. Can I get it? Oh, it's cool because, like, Jolteon will literally, like, walk right next to you when you're walking down the ship because, you know, like, the ship is moving. So, it, like, I don't know. Jolteon, like, pushed to the side or something. Like, see how it, like, just jumps in front of me like that? I'm trying to get it. No, that's not going to work. I don't know. It looked cool to me. It may look cool to you guys. It may look stupid to you guys. But I can't appease everyone. Oh, yeah, you just come out from nowhere. Hey, you. I knew you were somewhere on this boat. Yeah, I just had to go for a bit of a nap. How could you sleep at a time like this? What do you mean? There's so many great trainers here to battle against. Weird. What's weird? It's just surprising hearing that from you. You weren't kidding when you said you were going to let... You were going to be a legit Pokemon trainer. Oh, shut up. I'm still mean when I want to be punk. That's a bit more like it. That <laughs> face. The reason I was looking for you was because I wanted a battle. <laughs> I expected as much. Yeah. Wait. If it's a battle you want... I'll give you a battle. Am I good as far as typings? Probably not, but whatever. Spark? Oh yeah, I have Spark. Good job me for remembering that. I got Shadow Punch now, nice. Uh, throw water at people. Oh, you really would miss the Kalava, wouldn't you? That was the main reason why I did it. Spark. Uh... I don't know, Shadow Punch. You. That doesn't even look like a punch. Spark. Surf. Don't do stuff like that. Okay, there we go. Now we hit the Kalava. Oh, come on! You can't do that! Well, you're gone. Yeah, you're gone. Uh. Yeah, let's do that. And then double kick. Kalava, I guess. And then we're going to Shadow Punch the Clava. And Croconaw can't do shit because it's blind. I forget about that. Okay, well. Double Kick Bayleaf. Can we get rid of this thing, please? Shadow Punch. There we go. There we go. Yo. I'll say it after this. Not again. It was a good battle. Yeah, but it's still frustrating. I can't seem to beat you. You're much better than before. Let me ask you something. You defeated the leader of Team Rocket, right? Yeah. Amazing. Giovanni's the strongest, strongest trainer I know. Wait, how do you know him? Well, he's my father. What? Yeah, I'm the son of Team Rocket's boss. Fun fact. I don't know what to say. I guess it does explain a lot. Silver, I am your father. I don't know why I had to fit that in there. Uh, yeah. So stupid, I just skipped that. He was also a pathetic father, spending all his time in his gym. It got even worse after mother, after he started Team Rocket. Wow, cliffhanger. The reason I started to train Pokemon was to defeat him at his own game. I had a chance to face him myself, but I just couldn't. 
I knew I was not strong enough. But you did it. You defeated him. I thought he was invincible. But he's human after all. Don't sweat it. I have no doubt that one day you're going to defeat him yourself. I suppose you're right. B to D, we'll meet again. And I assure you, I won't go down so easily the next time we fight. Sounds good to me. Alright, so I was thinking how crazy he's going to be when all those Pokemon are evolved. So when I'm another summon stone. When I'm fighting like a freaking Frolligator, Typhlosion, and Meganium. Oh, he did it! Damn it, but the stupid guy got in the way. He saw for like a split second how he's like walking next to me. I love how Jolteon just sits there and watches me sleep. That's kind of creepy. It's a little creepy. Like, that Jolteon would have that much of an obsession, you know? Pokemon are fucking creepy, bro. Like, do you imagine having a Hypno and like, as you're like, Pokemon, it's like, oh, there we go, I got it. And like, Hypno's just sitting there like, staring at you while you're asleep. Yeah, now you guys won't play Pokemon ever again. Okay. Hey, look, dots. I wonder what that can mean. Um, you're pretty close to being a alligator. Not bad. I guess it wasn't the captain who wanted me. Rather, M. Or is it? Where is she? Oh, I have to walk back. So. We finally meet. Who are you? You already know the answer. Zero? That master hypervisor? Hey, you must be BDD. Wait, how would I know that? I've never seen this guy before. I, I mean, I've seen him in, like, cutscenes, but, like, I like Gold has never seen Zero. I don't know. There must be something. You have been an unexpected thorn in my side. I wouldn't have expected a human to be the biggest threat to my plan. Two of my brethren have died because of you. How much blood will you shed in your useless crusade to prolong your existence? That's rich coming from the guy who wants to kill the entire world. The third generation will happen. I have ignored your meddling for far too long. This will be the end of your journey. <laughs> so you want to fight, huh? Well, you don't scare me. I am the master hypervisor. You don't stand a chance. It's time to cut off the thorn. Damn. This is kind of scary. And they play the starting theme for this battle. It's kind of nice little touch. Now, the thing with Zero is you can see he's red, right? And he just used a fire move. So right now, he is a fire type. But, he won't be a fire type for this entire battle. Man, I should actually have a point on right now. Um, he will change into a different type very soon, based on how much damage I do to him. I don't want to keep using Water Whip, but I'll have to. And yeah, so if I could damage him a little quicker, that'd be nice. I kind of need a smog. Uh, let me see. My chop, you need to learn better moves. Okay, well. Water Whip. Let's see, there we go. So I think you are now a Water type. Am I right? Because he could be a Poison type too. And I just, yeah, he's a Water type. I just use Water Whip on him. Okay. So we'll just keep double kicking with my chop, I guess. Shadow Fan, or Shadow Claw, Spark. Now you're a grass type, okay? Now I'll switch to Flareon. Shadow Punch. So, Ice Fang. And the chop just keep kicking him. Okay. Oh, now you're. I think you're a ground type. Now I have to switch again. Maybe I'll just stick with. Uh, Stick with Flareon. Yeah, you're a ground type. I mean, I know ground's strong with fire, but I don't want to keep this switching the entire time. Because, like, I didn't even get an attack in with Flareon before he switched. Now he's a poison type. 
pretty sure is this poison. So, let's go ahead and do that. And you are now done, Zero. But obviously, this isn't the end of him. <gasps> I get a Frolligator! Yes! I won't go down so easily. I was merely testing your strength. It's not hard to see how both Vanish 23 and Lionheart fell to you. You're using that special Eevee. And you've gathered a team of Pokemon. Let us see how you fare without them. My Pokemon! And yeah, this is a um, this is a losing battle. I'm gonna lose. Oh yeah, he just uses this attack, and I'm instantly dead. <laughs> it's like, why didn't you do that when I was playing you? Dissociative. Don't die on me. He's going to heaven. I'll miss you, Evie. Oh wait. There's actually tears in my eyes. And Eveon! Yeah, I hate this thing. We're not gonna use this. <laughs> well, that's new. What is this? This Joseph, let's rock. I'm not using Eveon. <laughs> it's kinda dumb because it like knows all these moves. Like look at this. Look at this. <laughs> Psybeam, Thunderfang, Flame Claw, Bubble Beam. Like what the hell? Uh, you guys kind of need to like. Shit, I don't have like a. And he's attacking me, so that kind of is annoying. Oh, that's what Mean Look does. Well, you guys are gonna have to recharge. Um, the chop, you just keep kicking him. But yeah. Um, fun fact, I guess. I'm doing a shit ton of damage. Um, I had a Eevee. I used to call my Eevees uh, Eeveon in this uh, game, and this is before the update for uh, this current version I'm playing right now. This is before this, and then when I saw this thing, I'm like, nope, can't call it Eeveon anymore. <laughs> it like evolved into Eeveon. I'm like, wait, I already have this thing. <laughs> Just with. Out all the stupid moves. But yeah, we're sticking with the evolutions, guys. I don't really like it that much. And wow, Croconaw just turned levels up to level 31, okay. Possible defeated twice. Although I'm using only a fraction of my power, I didn't expect you to defeat me. You're growing faster than I expected. You were fortunate in this encounter, but your luck will run out soon. Obviously, we'll see him again. 13 days left. You're back. You don't look so good. That trainer, he's far more powerful than I imagined. But how? He's using a Pokemon that has been created using Ark's power. So it has the ability to create viruses? Is that how Lionheart and Vanish 23 died? I thought when we defeated Ark, viruses would be no more. Corrupted Pokemon, and now viruses? Ark's power is somehow returning. It's the fourth wall weakening. <laughs> They're breaking the fourth wall, okay. Surely this can't all be M's doing. Cliffhanger after cliffhanger after cliffhanger. Across the sea. Oh, it was kind of obvious we were going across the sea. We're in a freaking boat. BDD, I'm happy to see you're, you are alive. Me too. I never expected Zero to attack you directly. But for some reason, battling Zero has allowed Eevee to generate more evolutions. Ones which don't exist in the third generation. Yeah, that surprised me too. I have also located your next target. Geo Sigma is hiding in Frig Town. It's one of the destinations along the fairy's path. And we get Fralligator. Yes. Look at that thing. Yeah, now we got power. Loud noises. Okay. Loud noises! Attention passengers, we have now docked at Ignis Island. We hope you enjoyed your trip. Well, what was that? 
Well, that was one hell of a boat ride. Yeah, the craziest boat ride I've ever been on. Alright. We went across the sea, as the chapter said. Sea chapters don't lie. Okay, so now we're here, and my man man's full. Oh yeah, I can't have this Eevee on thing. We're not doing that. Yeah, we're not doing this. You be a... Uh, Vaporeon. I'm not, I'm not doing that Eevee on thing. Lots of stuff, more stuff, plenty of stuff, so much stuff, stuff keeps coming, more stuff, okay. I have to do that every time I use my main man. So there's a gem, we won't be going there in this episode. Uh, unless I have to. I can't go here, oh, well. <laughs> look at this. Can I go in here? Oh, I think you need surf for this. <laughs> Cold Springs? Okay. <laughs> That's hilarious. Now, the thing is, I don't think I can do this yet. Oh, fuck. I need to get the gym badge. I want to go over there. Damn it. Um... I can't do anything over here, can I? If I could just go to Amber Woods, that'd be perfect, because I don't have that I don't have a ton of time left and I just want to do like one little thing. But eh. We'll just go fight. Do I really want to fight Chuck in this episode? Um I guess I will. These guys shouldn't be too hard, right? I don't know if I'll actually fight him. I'll just leave cliffhangers because, you know, that's what I do best. Uh, you throw water at people. I don't know what I did, but I did something. I don't think it was good. Uh, why don't throw? Eh, uh, sure. Uh, the primate. Okay. Alligator, you throw water at people. And Mankey's almost gone. Okay. Psybeam, you. That's a lot of damage. Ow. Throw water at people. Yeah. Now we're shadow punching you. And I didn't mean Psybeam, but I'll Psybeam. Okay. These guys aren't too bad. Oh, yes. Ominous Wind. Impressive sun. Impressive sun. Okay. Battling is in my blood. Flows from my nostrils. Oh, I keep. Yeah, that looks cool, doesn't it? I keep forgetting I can't use helping hand for Haunter, and it's the stupidest thing ever. Wish they would get rid of that. I want to make Gengar like stupid OP. Well, I might get a Machamp, so... Look at that. I don't think I get the attack boost that you normally get from Ominous Wind. Okay. Why am I getting, like, a thousand Novice Belts? Ooh, I got Baton Pass. There we go. There we go. I can start using that for strategy. And you have a Hariyama. And a hair cross and a balloon. Let's do that because it looks cool. Why else would we use a move? Oh, I thought I thought that was from Ominous Wind. Uh, I'm like half paying attention right now. Uh, yeah. I wish there was a psychic attack that could hit all three, but there isn't. So yeah. Recharge. Ow. Side beam on you, I guess. Kind of want to get rid of the balloon. I'm gonna throw water at you guys again because that's what I do. Uh, yeah, that's kind of annoying. Uh, side beam you. I'll throw. Uh, 
Do that. Ice Fang, you. Psybeam. Vile Throw. Uh, I can't do shit. The moves take up way too much PP. There goes that. Now the Hariyama. Alright. Lots of stuff. Bruce is now level 28. And Bruce will now be a Machoke. Yeah. Alright, so normally, if you guys have followed my, if you guys kind of catching my style by now, I usually leave the uh, gym leader for next episode. But you know what? I kind of don't want to do that. <laughs> because, I don't know, gym leader should be at the end of the episode, not at the beginning. But I mean, I don't know, get you guys interested in the next episode. Wah! So you've come this far. Let me tell you, I'm tough. Yeah, so am I. My Pokemon will crush stones and shatter bones. Come on, we shall do battle. Yes, we shall. Aw, oh, he doesn't carry a giant rock and show how strong he is. Look at how strong I am. But I have a bunch of Machops. <laughs> Alright, uh, yeah, let's confuse him, because why not? And then, I don't know, let's like, yeah throw water at people. Ow. Okay, and one fuse. Oh, I got three of them. Not bad. Uh, we'll do that. Yeah, that's right. I had to throw water at people. I didn't do that yet. Uh, do that again. Ow. Okay, so now we're gonna, like, smog. I don't know if that poisoned anyone, but yeah, throw more water at people. Okay. Psy beam. That's in. That's what you're doing. Okay, well, goodbye, him on top. And then we'll do this. I'm not doing anything to the polar rock yet, but we'll take care of that right now. Yeah, I think the next episode's gonna be good as is. There's gonna be a lot of stuff in it, so. Something for you guys to look forward to. Because that's what I'm supposed to do. I'm supposed to keep you guys interested, not just have you watch one episode and never watch me again. Right? <laughs> that's how you do YouTube, right? I think. I don't know. I'm kind of new to this. Yes, I got crunch. Alright. Wah, huh? I lost. How about that? You're much stronger than you look, Kit. K. K. Not kid. K. You're worthy of Storm Badge. You worthy Storm Badge. <laughs> but yeah, another one bites the dust. And another one does, and another one does, and another one bites the dust. You can take this too. Dynamic Punch. Electro Ball from Pikachu. Okay. Well. Oh, hi, Crystal. Damn it. Oh, hey, BDD. Hey, Crystal. How have you been? You got another Gym Badge, I presume. Yeah, that's my sixth one. Only two more. You're nearly there. Well, your next gym must be in Frigg City. It's on an island south of here. Sounds good. I should be able to take the ferry there, right? The ferry? They left a little while ago. Huh? What? Really? The next one isn't bound to arrive for a half a week. Half a week? I can't wait that long. Why don't you just surf? Really? You mean you surf in Pokemon? What? Huh? I came here by surfing directly from Portis City. Surfing? Yeah, surfing allows you to travel over water. There's a person on this island called the Surf Master. Wow. You'll, she'll teach you how to surf. Sounds great. Although, I'm not actually sure where she lives these days. You could probably ask her around. Okay, I'll look for the Surf Master. Well then, I should leave you to it. I have a Tropius to find. See ya. Okay. That was a very, very, um intelligent conversation even though I know where the surf master is but we will find the surf master in the next episode so I hope you guys uh, enjoyed the episode like comment subscribe do all that good stuff 
Um, we're nearing the end of Super Pokemon Eevee. I hate to say it to you guys, but uh, we just faced the last gym layer we possibly could. But the story is going to get very, very interesting. Um, there's a giant cliffhanger at the very end of this episode, so uh, don't spoil yourself by watching their Super Pokemon Eevee videos. Watch mine, please, because I need all the attention I can get. <laughs> Anyways, um, I'm going to end off here, so uh, thank you guys for watching, and I will see you guys in the next episode. Keep dreaming, my friends. Bye-bye.